Hang it. Fire. Nighttime in southern Afghanistan can be dangerous, with mountains and wide open land allowing the Taliban and other insurgents to roam freely. And sometimes spotting them can be difficult, even with night vision. I can't see. I'm up so that's when they call in Sergeant Jonathan Speth, a mortarman attached to Ghost Platoon 4-2 with the 2nd Cavalry Regiment. And tonight, his mission is to light up the night sky to make sure that there's no enemy forces out doing anything shady or trying to disrupt any activity that we have planned for CAF or FOBLNC. Firing illumination rounds are very important to the operations at Kandahar Airfield, or CAF for short. Not only does it show the enemy that we're out keeping a watchful eye over the area, it'll also prevent future attacks on CAF. Fire. Five, four, three, two, one. And when it comes to actually firing the mortars, Speth said it's pretty simple. Essentially how it works out is we will have a direction towards the target and set up a reference point that we know will not change position that we can aim off of in order to shift our cannon to hit anything that needs to be either illuminated or destroyed at that time. He remembers the first time he fired a mortar round. First time I ever shot one was back in basic training. I was one of the ones selected for the 120 millimeter cannon. And once that first round goes off though, it, it's definitely a feeling that you won't forget easily ever again. Reporting from Kandahar Province, Afghanistan, I'm Army Sergeant Carl Greenwell.